This show fuses magic, suggestion, misdirection, psychology, showmanship, and low budget camera trickery. I will acquire all of the results you'll see in this show through a varied use of these techniques. No out of work actors or stooges were used in the filming of this program. The brain is a remarkable organ. It is easily deceived if you know how, and I will be demonstrating this on a very willing member of the general public. Hi, my name is Garrett White. We're doing some filming. No. no just, just stop. No, stop. Yeah, come here. Ah, damn it, man. Right? There's no way to run. Stop. Ah, damn. It's all okay. My name is Garrett White. Okay. We're filming a program. All right. Your name is? Uh, John. John, nice to meet you. John. Sleep. Sleep all the way down. That's it, all the way down. Okay. Right, as you lay there, I want you to picture yourself in a green field surrounded by sheep. And just let those sheep surround you as if you're in a dream. And at the stroke of 12, you would reawaken. Here's a fun experiment I would like to try with you, the viewer. Do you often find yourself moving through life, constantly milking others for answers? Do situations seem black or white, all while you're stood alone in the park, semi-skimming stones across the lake? Do you often feel utter control by society, moving with the herd? Now, think of any animal. Have you got one? Was it a cow? You're probably wondering why you thought cow. The brain is easily deceived and suggestible. Let's look at that footage again. Did you see it? How, you ask? Simple. Your brain was so fixated on me that you missed what was directly in front of your nose. Now, who's up for a game of chess? Hi, Steve. No, no, it's Jamie. Uh, Jamie, thank you for joining us. Do you want to take a seat? So, thank you for joining us. Um, you know why you're here. We're going to play a game of chess. All right. Um, I've already given you a prediction this morning. Excellent. So, we're going to play chess. Game of chess, ten minutes. And then, once the timer is up, We'll explain what happens next. All right, yeah, excellent. We would play a game of ordinary chess for 10 minutes. The prediction I handed Joseph earlier was placed in a sealed envelope and neither he nor my team have seen it. But as you are all well aware, brain deception lurks around every corner. Okay, stop. That's the, the 10 minute timer done. You remember the prediction that I gave you this morning? Uh, the sealed envelope, if you want to open that now and have a look inside. Now I will have predicted the pieces you have taken as well as the way that you have laid them out. Want to read this out? You will have taken three pawns Two bishops, one rook, one queen, B, P, P, Q, R, B, P. Well, I mean, you're very close, Gareth, but but, but you're not right. I'm afraid yeah. to say it's, 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 it's wrong. Yeah, it's, um... Um... That's, that's embarrassing. I was, just, I was one out. Um... Well, it wasn't all about the game of chess. Just wait here for one moment.
I've never seen anything like that in my whole life. Never. And I'm a man of the Bible. So I know that man is troubled. It, I've got his clothes on. His, his, his chains. He's got my clothes, he has. He's nicked them. Crazy man. Crazy. <laughs>